congratulations on this really moving performance. Thank you. Um, I was wondering what it's like when you put your heart and soul into something like this um, and actually take us into the mind of the character and people who maybe haven't seen it yet come out and vocally criticize. How do you deal with that? I personally, you know, I, I take everyone's opinion in and I respect everyone's opinion. But for me, like, I did put my heart and soul into this project and so did Sia and so did Kate and so did Leslie, we all did. And we love this film so much. And I think for anyone that hasn't watched it, I would say give it a try because I think you might be transported into a beautiful world, which is music. The other thing I was wondering about because this movie is really about being seen and so many of us hide ourselves and um, Apparently, uh, uh, forgive me if I, I don't have this right, uh, you were a reality star? Yes, I Okay, was. so, um, you know, how is that for a young person? Because so many people want fame without understanding what it is. And people want to be seen, but I would imagine that's a different form of being seen. So how do you protect yourself? Yeah, um, that's actually a very good question. Um, since I started when I was eight years old on a reality show, it kind of all happened at once. And I didn't realize the audience that it would, you know, eventually get and being thrown into it at such a young age, like there's so much that I, you know, was exposed to in a sense that like, you know, I instantly had to grow up and, and work and I wouldn't change it because now I'm in an, in an amazing place and it's everything I've dreamed of but you know it's a lot of pressure and I think at a young age there's been so many times where I've just wanted to be at home and hide and just like you know not be seen by the world and I think now that we're <laughs> in a pandemic <laughs> things have changed a little bit um but like ultimately I found my close group of friends and so now I feel confident enough to share little parts of my life but I've learned that when you're in the public eye, the rest of your life can be very private. And that's how I've tried to have it. Because when I was younger, being on a reality show, they show your life, they show everything that's in front of you, and it can be a lot. And I think now as I've gotten older, I've learned to keep my privacy to myself, and learn to only share special moments with the world. So it's kind of like picking my battles and deciding what and what not I want to share. That's such an important lesson for all of us. Um, this role involves singing and dancing, and of course, incredible acting from you. Um, you. When you have to express yourself, um, which of the three mediums do you prefer? Like if you're happy and if you're sad? Yeah, I mean, dance is my first love and it's the way that I've learned to express myself through movement. And I think that's, I think that's why I love music as playing that character, because in my life, there's been so many times where I've not figured out how to express what I'm feeling. So I dance if I'm happy, but I can't express that I dance. If I'm sad and I can't express that I dance. So I think that's why I related to this movie and felt, oh my gosh, I feel a connection to this is because I've grown up having an experience where I express myself through this dream world that I've created and it's beautiful. And I think everyone can relate to that in a sense. And I'm just so honored that I was able to dance and act in a movie and sing, even though I, I'm so bad at singing, but um, <laughs> I, I, it's crazy that all the worlds came together in one. Well, I didn't see you being bad at anything. I just saw somebody really owning every moment up there. So it was lovely uh, talking to you. Oh, Looking nice forward to see you next time. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Bye.